morning and thank you for joining us for the CBS 19 This Morning Update. I'm Dana Huey. And I'm Clint Yates. Today will be an incredibly sad day for students returning to Alto High School after a tragedy on the football field Friday night. Cameron Matthews, a football player at the school, died Saturday night after being airlifted to a hospital during Friday night's game. Saturday night, a vigil was held for Cameron Matthews at Yellow Jacket Stadium. Everyone from teammates, friends, and family members were saddened to hear about Matthew's passing. A prayer was held, and soon after, people circled the field. Alto Superintendent Kerry Birdwell says Cameron will be missed. He is uh, he's why we go into the profession. He just was a, just a great kid. Um, just every day, his uh, consistency was the, was the key with Cameron. He always had a smile on his face. He was always yes sir, no sir. Um, it made the day a joy to be up here at the school around Cameron. Cameron is the sixth high school football player to die this season. That number is troubling some school districts. Some have even considered removing football teams altogether.